Hello everybody, this is Brother Luke, Sin City Preacher. I'd like to take a couple of minutes now to recommend and introduce you to another one of my playlists. This one is titled, The Book of Proverbs, a Verse-by-Verse -verse Commentary. So, the, the style of video, the style of Bible study or teaching for this is a verse-by-verse -verse commentary. Uh, I go through the book of Proverbs one verse at a time. It takes a long time to get through it. Uh, there's 46 videos on the playlist. Uh, they average about an hour each. Some are two hours, some are less than an hour. So there's a lot of content. Uh, and of course the book of Proverbs was written by King Solomon. Uh, and the purpose of the book, he says in the beginning, is to teach his son what Solomon has learned about wisdom and pass, pass this on to his son. So by reading and studying the book of Proverbs, uh, we should be wiser because of it. Um, it's, a, it's a very... Uh, enjoyable book to, to read. It's not a, it, like other books of the Bible where um, the book is a historical account of uh, people and events uh, like uh, the book of Genesis uh, or, or the, the Gospel of John or pretty much all the other books are true historical records of real people and real events. The book of Proverbs is a series of one-liners, sometimes two or three or four verses to complete a thought. But it's a series of, quote, Proverbs, little, little uh, gems, uh, nuggets of truth to help us learn to be wise. And it would be wise to not only read it and study it, but to apply it. In fact, that, that's the difference between wisdom and knowledge. Uh, you see, Solomon talks about understanding, about knowledge, and about wisdom. So under, understanding is simply that you understand something. Uh, knowledge is you have knowledge of it. But wisdom is applying your understanding and knowledge, putting it into application uh, for your benefit. So um, I hope you will watch this, uh, and, and I, I look forward to your comments if you do. Bless you in the name of our great Savior God, Jesus.